The big story here at 10, and it's all new for you. The Dallas Police Department is responding to some concerns tonight. The district attorney's office says missing evidence could be putting criminal cases in jeopardy. And we know that the problem's already delayed a murder trial, but our J.D. Miles reports for you tonight. There's a little bit of disagreement right now over what the overall impact will be. A judge's decision to delay the murder trial of a woman accused of killing Maricela Botello turned a spotlight on a problem inside the Dallas Police Department. Digital files containing mostly videos and photos related to the case were not turned over to the defense as required by the court. That's because those files were missing, along with as many as 52,000 others related to thousands of criminal cases. Well, this is a very big deal. Dallas lawyer Toby Shook says the revelation that the digital files may be lost because they were improperly cataloged will give him and other criminal defense attorneys a field day, attacking the credibility of officers when their clients go on trial. This evidence has been lost. Uh, it will be a relevant uh, 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 form of cross-examination for the detectives to, to for a defense attorney, a good defense attorney, to attack the credibility of the actual investigation. There is concern that the missing files could cause the recent convictions of violent criminals to be overturned. The Dallas County DA issued a statement addressing that concern, saying, quote, To our knowledge, my office has not been notified of cases that have been fully adjudicated that have been found to be missing evidence. We're talking 52,000 out of 3.2 million, um, so this is not some major a problematic issue. Dallas Police Association President Mike Mata says the vast majority of the missing digital evidence is not pertinent to their cases. 52,000 pieces of evidence is not the evidence that you that normal people would think that you know that you see on TV. That's not all this evidence. A lot of this are just digital video from traffic stops, you know, from a from a uh, somebody who wrote a ticket or from a traffic accident. It's just videos that haven't been tagged. But will convicted criminals be successful using it as the basis for an appeal? In reality, uh, I don't think that's going to really happen. Dallas police want to emphasize that while the missing digital video files may be hard to find, only those that are over two years old and weren't properly cataloged have been deleted. In Dallas tonight, J.D. Miles, CBS News, Texas.